realized what we're doing but guys it's too late we have too many win conditions on his king tower and we're gonna give him the good game that worked perfectly guys what's going on guys it's your boy mars back with another clash royale video and guys in today's video we're gonna be trying to three crown some people with this mirror rocket cycle deck in the Legendary's Infinite Elixir Challenge. These battles are not gonna be like normal battles, and if you've already played the Infinite Elixir Challenge, you know exactly what I'm talking about, but guys, without further ado, let's hop into these games. But guys, before we hop into today's battles, just wanna remind you to smash that like button and click the little fireball in the corner to subscribe to the channel. Doing those little things takes like one or two seconds, but it benefits my channel tremendously, and I really appreciate it. All right, guys, we're hopping into the first game here, and we have no time to waste. We gotta get right at it with the spell cycle gotta get to the rock the uh mirror so we can do the rocket mirror rocket on his king tower then we're gonna go earthquake poison and just cycle all the cheap cards to get back to the rocket mirror rocket guys look at his king tower just losing health at a ridiculous pace and we're back to the rocket mirror rocket and guys i think we got him already I think if we go with that mirror rocket and the earthquake, that's going to be GG well played. And he was barely able to take our first tower. Guys, this challenge is absolutely hilarious. All right, we're playing AK Scorpion, but honestly, not for long. We're just going to be going right in here. We need the mirror though. Okay, there we go. We got the mirror. Guys, why hasn't he played anything yet? I'm really confused. Uh, but there he goes in with the giant skeleton. But guys, I think it's honestly going to be too late for AK Scorpion right here. He's going to start rocketing me as well though. Honestly, not surprised, but guys, we got a lead on him at the beginning, and we are not going to give up that lead anytime soon. We're going to go Rocket Mirror Rocket, and I think that's going to be GG here. Guys, these games literally take like 30 seconds, and boom, there we go with the three crown Rocket Mirror Rocket cycle, guys. All right, third battle here, and guys, honestly, this kind of gets old after you do it like three or four times, so I might just start... Um, going in with like a different deck in the next battle here because guys this guy thinks he's gonna reach our tower with that pekka and stuff but it's honestly not gonna happen just gonna go in for another poison here and guys i think this last rocket mirror rocket should do it and if it doesn't then we have the earthquake and the poison his troops are approaching my tower though guys this is a little bit scary but I'm gonna go in with the poison and the earthquake and i think we got him all right guys quick update here i'm midway through the challenge and i'm gonna be switching it up here from the spell cycle deck to this absolutely crazy all win condition deck we have eight win conditions here and we're just gonna be rushing our opponent's tower and seeing if we can get the dub all right guys first game here with the all win condition deck uh we're going against sylvester here and we're just gonna rush with all of our win conditions here and guys look at this game right here we're already about to take his first tower we're gonna go goblin giant with some royal hogs here on this side and this guy's actually playing a lot of defense right now but uh it doesn't matter we're just gonna rush with all of our win conditions on this left side now and look at that guys we're able to take that tower out and guys let's come in straight for the three crown here i think he's finally realized what we're doing but guys it's too late we have too many win conditions on his king tower and we're gonna give him the good game that worked perfectly guys guys this might be the best deck for this challenge the all win condition deck here you just cram as many win conditions down your op opponent's throat as you can and we are gonna take the dub here guys look at that already taking out one tower He's going in for a graveyard, but guys, look how many win conditions we have on his king tower. We're three crowning people in like 20 seconds. This is ridiculous. All right, guys, now that I'm almost done with the challenge here, we're just going to switch it up to another spell cycle deck. And every card in this deck is just straight up direct damage. So we're just going to be playing every card on their king tower and see how fast we can three crown people. All right, guys, we have no time to waste here. Basically, the strategy is just to... Um, cycle all the spells until we get to the mirror and there we go looks like this guy's using a very similar strategy here but i think we're going to be able to take him out before he can take us out able to get back to the rocket there and gonna mirror that as soon as we can gonna earthquake snowball arrows zap and now we can rocket him again and guys i think that's pretty much going to be gg i don't think he's going to be able to get there in time as long as we fireball and snowball here, that's going to be GG. There we go, guys. Wow, he was like one second away from getting me, but 
We took the dub too fast, guys. All right, here, we're going up against Kush Kush for our last game here, and we're going to get to our Rocket, Mirror Rocket, and he's going to say good game. I'm not sure why, if he thinks he's going to win or lose, but either way, guys, we're going to get back to our Rockets here. Going to get both of those down. Then we're going to go with the Earthquake, the Poison, and the Snowball, and then we're going to get back to the Rockets here. And, guys, he just fireballed to the side. He gave up. He knows that it's GG if we just go in for one more rocket, earthquake, and poison. And look at how fast we just three crowned that guy to finish off the challenge, guys. There we go, guys. We're going to get the log from him from this. And now we are done with the challenge. Anyways, guys, that's going to wrap it up for today's battles. It's probably going to end up to be a bit of a shorter video because all those wins only took like 30 seconds each. But anyways, guys, if you're still watching at this point, definitely thank you for watching and click that like button and the subscribe button if you haven't already. And I will see you guys tomorrow with another ladder pushing video for 6,000 trophies.